And we are back. I just got done resting up at a camp. Get Goku back to uh, fighty status. And I super strong guys. They're all over the place. Should probably do this on my controller. There we go. Now I'm back. Alrighty, let's do the thing with the stuff. Bye, Vegeta. Bonk. I didn't like that mountain anyway. What the? Hey, who are you? Kakarot, you finally show your face. A carrot. Gohan, here you go. It's a sensu bean. Give some to the others, too. I'm gonna fight these guys on my own. Ha! You wanna fight me? No. What's a puny little guy like you gonna do? Not gonna be so much of a fight. There's no way you can beat me! It's not gonna be so much of a fight as it is. Gonna... With one hit. It's my turn now. Okay, bullshit. I really fucking hate that. I hate it. Thanks. I hate it, thanks. Fucking hard. I pressed B, whatever. Okay, I hate it, thanks. Coming from Raccoon. All right, 
I think it's finally time to show you my best stuff. Raccoon! Ultra! No, thank you. Return to sender, please. Sorry. You were wide open, so I just went for it. You... You... The most dignified death in Dragon Ball Z, I'm pretty sure. Ass in the Damn. air. How is this possible? He's already gone beyond a Saiyan power level. But how? What kind of training has he put himself through to achieve this? Wait. Are the stories more than legends? Could it possibly be? Is he the legendary Saiyan warrior that appears once every thousand years? Is he actually a Super Saiyan? What about you guys? You gonna go back to your own planet or what? Or do you want to end up like this guy over here? Whoa! You hear that, bird, huh? This spiky-haired wimp must be out of his mind! Not particularly. Yeah, he actually believes that he has the power to take down Raccoon. Um, oh, he just got lucky. Raccoon wasn't fighting at his best that day. Yeah, that was a fluke. I mean, his power level didn't even go over 5,000. Here we go! Yeah! Seizure procedure. Alright, who do I beat first? Let's... So, you won't go back, huh? Use this! No way! way. Ah! Burda. Burda. Chase. You're pissing me off, Chase. Pissing me off, Jason Burder. Not bad enough of your shit. Bye. Oh, let me follow up. Great time to turn on Kaioken. If I take out one of you, it's fine. Burger's going first, though. And I'll do that damn Space Australian. God damn it, Chase, in the wrong. That's pretty neat. I don't remember Goku struggling with them, though. Alright, Jace. Space Australia doing?
I right, just end it with that. Works for me. No seizure procedure. Kakarot's rapidly increasing his power level at the exact moment he lands a strike. He, he must be trying to conserve his energy. That power spike is probably too quick for even their advanced scouters to detect. His power level is unbelievable. How can... Do you understand now? Just give up already. And look... Uh, uh, this must be some sort of nightmare. Yeah. How can we elite warriors be so space spiders against this guy? Space Australian spiders. Your naivete makes me sick. Why would you let them get away with that? You may have grown stronger, but that doesn't make you a super saiyan. Far from it. Yeah, no, he hasn't turned yellow super yet. Super saiyan. I can see that you're proud of how much you've increased your power, but that won't be nearly enough to defeat Frieza. Frieza, huh? That's the guy King Kai told me about. Wait, so even after all the training I did, you're saying I'm still not strong enough to beat him? That's exactly what I'm telling you. Frieza possesses more power than you could ever possibly imagine. Uh, maybe you're wrong. I mean, you saw what Goku can do, right? I mean, those guys couldn't even lay a finger on him. Goku is unstoppable. Then fight him and find out for yourself. But that's not all. Breeze has probably already used the Dragon Balls to wish for immortality. No, I I don't think he's done that yet. What? How would you know? Magic. Space well, magic. If it's like using the Dragon Balls on Earth, the sky should get really dark and Shinron appears. Yeah. But it's been bright this whole time, which means he probably hasn't made his wish. Shen what? What the heck's a Shinron? You mean something comes out of the Dragon Balls? <laughs> I fucking can't with all the penis jokes that are running through my mind. Oh yeah, that's right. Something sure does come out of those of Dragon Balls of Vegeta. That means we still have a chance to make our wish. Hooray! <laughs> Appears we've got some company arriving. Looks like- Wait. Where's Frieza? I thought for sure he'd be back in his ship with the Dragon Balls that Captain Ginyu brought him. I'm sensing some massive energy over there. Uh, over there? No, oh, we're in big trouble now. Oh no, Frieza's probably going to force Guru to tell him how to make a wish with the Dragon... Yeah, and once he's figured that out, he's going to kill Guru for sure. I mean, he already told you he only has like a day or two left to live. Know. He won't be able to use the Dragon Balls if Guru dies. What? That settles it. Krillin and Gohan, you two get the Dragon Balls. Right. And if we, we have to find Bulma and get the Dragon Radar. Yeah, good idea. Good luck, guys. Goku, go get him! Come on, Vegeta, let's go. We're gonna go. Fine. Oh, look at that. Being non best you're friend, best a lot friends. Stronger now that you've recovered from a near death experience. <laughs> so, you know about that, huh? They're the same level. How does that work? And Goku was markedly stronger. Wait a minute. If neither Frieza nor Ginyu are back on the ship, then that means the ship's completely defenseless right now. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some real guts, you know that? The captain's gonna make you pay for what you- oh, This is the guy, huh? His power level's around 5,000. Just like we said, makes no sense, right? Absurd. Relying too much on your scouter is a rookie mistake. Most likely, he has the ability to instantly increase his power. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? Science don't have that much power. Promising. This will be an enjoyable battle. The first in a long... All right. Let's do this, Vegeta. Kakarot and Ginyu are more or less equal in terms of power. If I'm lucky enough, maybe the two of them might... This is the end of the line for you. Maybe. Farewell, Kakarot! Vegeta! Here I go! 
dick. Man, I can't believe Vegeta ditched me like that. I guess he probably thinks he can get his hands on the Dragon Ball while me and Emma are fighting out. I know I just got here, but let's get this show on the road. You're a cop. Why not you? But not for long. The mighty Captain Ginyu will put you in your place. Oh, Can you guys fuck off? Jesus. Between two of them, I can't get a shot in anyways. Can you guys fuck off? I swear to fuck. Some charges in. That's not what I wanted to do, but it'll work. I guess. Sort of fuck him alone. Thank fuck. All right, can you? Okay. That was probably more one of the more rugged fights that I had to deal with. And he was relentless as fuck. Are, are you? No, no, you can't be. Are you? Are you a Super Saiyan? Vegeta said something about that too. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. S S Super Saiyan? You mean? You mean? The legendary warrior? No! This cannot be! Okay. Is this guy really the only thing in the universe that even Lord Frieza is afraid of? I don't know about that, but what I do know is that I'd like to avoid fighting if I can. So listen up. Just leave the planet. I'm saying this for your own good. What? Are you joking? No. no I'm serious. I don't want to kill I'm not sure you guys, if he knows what a joke is. To. 
I've heard that the Super Saiyan is the ultimate warrior, one that lives only for battle and bloodshed. Oh, oh I get it. You're not actually a Super Saiyan, are you? Doesn't matter. He, he beat your ass. But be that as it may, your power is still far greater than my own power. <laughs> <laughs> What's funny? Jace, take my scouter. What? What are you doing? Shanking himself. <laughs> that body of yours is pretty strong. Yes, and I think I'll take it. Change! Dodge. So <laughs> I had to do. So I had to do was dodge. But no. What's going on? What? What? What am I doing all the way over there? We've made a trade. Your body is mine now. Dick. Hey, Captain. Here's your scout. Right. Now, back to the ship. It's possible Lord Frieza may have returned already. <laughs> <laughs> so this is why he damaged his own body. It all makes sense now. Yeah, a little bit. I'm in serious trouble. If I don't hurry, I'm... Wait, no. He's gonna meet up with Krillin and the others. That's it. Wait a second. Even if I make it back to Earth, Chi-Chi probably wouldn't be all too happy seeing me the way I am right now. Yeah. Can't say she'd probably be happy getting a big purple monster. You never know, though. He seems to have sniffed us out. It won't be much longer until he's here. Now. You must go. Take take little green and get out of here. Need you. But make sure you spit on their face oh, first. Okay. I understand, but, but please don't die, Grand Elder Guru. He's going to do that anyway. He already... This is already a plot point he has said is going to happen. I suppose I'll let this one live. There's no sense wasting my time with a single speck of dust. What do you want? Greetings and salutations. My name is Frieza, and I've come to your humble little planet in search of the Dragon Ball. Fear not, as I have already managed to gather all seven of them. Though it would seem I am unable to draw upon their power, which is what brings me to the lot of you. Tell me what I must do in order to grant my wish. I suggest you leave. We have no intention of telling monsters like you. Yeah, I can't blame them. I would be more forthcoming if I were you. Although I do not intend to kill you, I will use force if necessary. There are two of you, yes? I don't care which one of you it is, but one of you will tell me. Fine. If that's how it's going to be. Grand Elder Guru, the creator of the Dragon Balls, resides here. If you kill him, the dragon... Hmm? Nail, my son. You must hold him off as long as you... Understood, my lord. I see. But I'm curious. Don't you wonder if he'll still refuse to tell me what I need to know when he sees that you're about to die? I won't go down as easy as you think. Nail. But we're not going to fight here. Grand tits. Elder Guru doesn't have much longer to live. Oh, very well then. Oh my, that's quite impressive. You've somehow managed to raise your power level to 42,000. Such a feat for the likes of you. But just to give you a sense of scale, allow me to inform you of what you're truly up against. My power level, you see, 
is 530,000. Rest assured, however, I haven't the slightest intention of fighting you with my full power. That's enough! Uh huh. How's it working out for you, Nail? Where are the Dragon Balls? They're either hidden somewhere or Frieza's holding on to them. Wherever they are, those Earthlings are sure to find them with that contraption of theirs. But before they get the chance, I must mask my power. They'll quickly realize I'm here otherwise. This should work. Once those runts summon that Shenron creature, I'll kill them and get my wish granted. It won't be long until I run into them. I should change into a new battle suit while I have the ch Yeah, get that space armor. Krillin! The Dragon Balls are over there! Gotcha! Let's go, Gohan! Somebody's cooking bacon in the house, and it smells amazing. God damn it, why am I back to like Gohan? Swear to fuck. I hope my dad's alright. Of course he's alright. He's Goku. Plus, Vegeta's with him. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, sure, that makes everything better. Fucking idiots. Dragon Balls aren't in the ship. Looks like no one's around. Now's our chance to look for the Dragon Ball. So, they actually buried them in the... Huh. We've got all... Ah, so that's where they... Hurry and summon that Shenron creature. Once that thing makes an appearance, I'll trash the kids and finally make my wish for... Harunga appears. Harunga. I forgot what its name was. Right. Come forth, Shinron, and grant our wishes! Uh, nope. Nothing happened. What's going on? Where's... Maybe the phrase you use is different to summon him here. Damn it. What the hell are those two doing? Quillen, someone's come... <laughs> yeah, there's two of them, and they got some wicked power. One of them's that Ginyu guy. D does... does that mean my dad lost? What the? Goku, did you beat Ginyu and befriend one of his men or something like that? Well, they he does tend to do this. Bulls. How did you do that? What do you mean? Obviously, we... Dragon Radar. So, did you already make your wish? Well, it's the craziest thing. We tried to summon Shinron, but it just... Uh, you know, there's something different about you, Goku. Uh, that's a scouter, isn't it? Why are you wearing one of those? Go Krillin, that's not my dad. Huh? Gohan, what do you mean it's not your dad? I don't know how to explain it, but I know it's not him. This body no longer belongs to that Saiyan. I couldn't resist its power. Wait, what did you say? <sighs> yeah. Hmm? And you're... Krillin, go on. <laughs> wow, you actually made it this far. <laughs> That's correct. I am the mighty leader of the Ginyu Force, Captain Ginyu. <laughs> no, it can't be. That's my. He swapped bodies. All this really complicates things. Go on, Krillin. I know you two have what it takes to get rid of this guy. Don't hold anything back. I can't. You're talking as if you think they can win. Remember, this is your body. Yeah, you're right about one thing. As long as my mind is separated from it, you can't unleash the full power it's capable of. You fool. The great Captain Ginyu will not fall for such Such shenanigans. Get it on. Join in a fight, Captain. Oh, I could totally make. Well then, if you're looking for a fight, why don't you try me on for some? Vegeta. We. Always, I'm always, I'm always here. Just doing Vegeta things. Finally, time to test this new body of mine out. Prepare your 
Oh, I should have charged that shit up quick. on the things. Okay, I guess we're doing the thing. Jesus. I have no idea what is going on here. Absolutely no idea what is going on here. Let's do the thing. I'd say he's probably done. Teamwork. Super Saiyan! Bizarre! Bye. No! This can't be happening! Chase couldn't have been defeated so easily! You're yeah. next! Dunk. Die! He's gonna do it. Yeah. Change! Nope, I make it. Bastard. That's not how this happened at all. How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> Looks like I'm back to being me again. What, what the hell just happened? What was that just now? Th that feels like my dad, all right. My dad, he's back in his own body. Ugh, damn it. This time, this time I'm taking Vegeta's body! Okay, there we go. Uh-oh. If he switches places with Vegeta, we're all done for. Not good. 
Ribbit. Now, your body is mine, Vegeta! Space Frog. Perfect! Sorry, Space Frog. Change! A frog. <laughs> Good job, Goku. You did the thing. <laughs> Tell me how to use the Dragon Balls. Tell me, and I'll put an end to your suffering. I may not be able to kill that elder of yours, but you, on the other hand, are expected. Consider this your final warning. Tell me how to grant my wish, or die! I'm assuming he probably doesn't care. <laughs> Dende Little Green. He's on his way to meet the Earth. He, he's going to tell them how to use the Dragon Ball. What? what? Yeah, the midget. You should have also called you a patak. Curse you! You were merely wasting my time, weren't you? I'm not picking up a signal from the Ginyu Force. No! All five of them couldn't have. They couldn't have all been defeated. No. Something must have happened between Vegeta, the Earthlings, and the Ginyu Force. And the Dragon Ball. Yep. He got played. The almighty Frieza will be the only one to make any wish. Not lower life forms like you! And into the pot you go. Time for a bath. This medical machine here, it should put you back in prime condition before you know it. Oh, and might as well give you some battle suits while we're at it. That way you'll at least be somewhat protected. Huh? Battle suits? You mean like that one? I don't really like how it looks. That's function over form, you son of a bitch. Whoa, this is crazy. It's super lightweight. It feels like I'm not wearing anything at all. And these shoulder pads don't really get in the way. We have all sorts of room to move. Go on. We should head over to Guru's place while Goku's recovering. If we don't find out how to summon Shenron, then we came all the way out here for nothing. Right. Go find out how to activate the Dragon Balls. I am going to rest up before this fight with Frieza. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah, you go do that, Majids. You take a nap. Let's hope we don't run into him first. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a moment out and get into a break. And we'll be back in a little bit. <laughs> 